Here's how the main characters of The Walking Dead TV show are different from the comics. We are The Walking Dead. Both tell the story of the collapse of society after a zombie apocalypse. There are some major differences between the two sets of characters. Rick Grimes is the leader of his group, which now resides in Alexandria. In the comic, Rick lost his hand in the first encounter with the governor, a character we said goodbye to in season four. Rick still has his hand in the TV show, despite several serious injuries. The show creators have said that it would be too difficult to film. Michonne is a samurai sword-wielding force in both the comics and the show. The TV show nailed her iconic entry to the series, but has taken some liberties with her current role, namely her relationship with Rick. Perhaps this is due to the death of another character. Remember Andrea? This expert markswoman was a member of the original group from Atlanta. She died in season three of the TV show in a shocking twist. In the comics, she is still alive in the most recent issue and is one of the most influential members of the group. She is also in a relationship with Rick. In contrast is Carol, a character who has long outlived her comic book namesake. Viewers love Carol in the Walking Dead TV show because she is a resilient and capable woman determined to survive. Today, we are talking about knives. However, in the comic series, she only makes it to issue 42, where she allows herself to be eaten by a walker. Let's talk about Negan, the villain of the moment. Hi. You're Rick, right? I'm Negan. We are the saviors. Jeffrey Dean Morgan drew a lot of inspiration from the comics for Negan's mannerisms, and the show has brought panels from the comics to life almost exactly. However, this actor's portrayal is decidedly less manic. Morgan has revealed in several interviews that adding more charm makes Negan work for television. One of Negan's right-hand men is Dwight. While the TV show remains pretty faithful to his comic book counterpart, viewers get an expanded look at the character's background before his face was burnt on the show. Dwight also shares some similarities to Daryl, a character who doesn't exist in the comics at all. Don't you know nothing? Daryl was introduced about two years before Dwight in the comics, and many were quick to notice that both carry a crossbow. Daryl quickly became a breakout fan favorite on the series. Your world's about to get a whole lot bigger. Do you want to see more character comparisons? Let us know in the comments below, and subscribe for our latest videos.